Good morning, guys. Guess what I have here in my hand? Well, it's a professional window cleaner used with this thing here also. So what you do is just to spray a little liquid on the window and then you're washing with this one like this and then you just scrape it off with this tool well i'm <laughs> i'm laughing because i'm far away from an expert but come with me and see how i'm doing maybe you will get a little laugh well, uh, the window's very dirty, so I thought I should do a little window cleaning. We'll see how fast I can do this, like a little competition just for myself. So I start to spray, and I'm using this professional <laughs> thing here to wash. And when that's done, I'm using this little scrape here and I wet it a little it's gonna be easier that's it huh and then we take it off and then we take the other side of the window it looks pretty simple huh it nice and shiny I'm just gonna take off here a little and I'm turning the window around this liquid will run down but it will not run. super clean and it's done and I have another nine windows to go well I show you another one come Well, that seems to be pretty easy, isn't it? But sometimes if you get a little stain or there is a little water left, well, I show you how to do that. It's easy also. I just, you see this little stain here? It's full of water here, you see? Then you just take a little piece of paper, a newspaper, and you just rub it. <clears throat> As good as new. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Well, guys, as I told you, if you have a little stain like this, uh, you can always use a newspaper. Just uh, put it good together like this. And you see the stain here? And I will just rub it a few times. And it's good as new. It's easy when you know how to. Uh, I know not everyone has windows in the world, glass windows, but you have a nice scenery and nice view anyway, right? First, we have to open, well, we open the window here, and then I have a little thing here, a security thing that might um, not be visible. As a little security thing, I have to push, and the same, I have to push the window at the same time. So here you have this extremely dirt here. So what we do is to spray a lot of amounts and take this tool and here I can feel we have to rub really hard and we're gonna use a little bit more time here because this window was more dirty than expected. But it's the same procedure, 
if you see some dirty spots you can oh well this one actually is painting it's not gonna go away but I have another idea for that one that's it and this one you just put it up in the corner like this and of course it's simple it's logical you just drag it like this right and just be moving it a little slowly and go up in the corner there and you fall coming down and turning around at the same time and then you go the other way here it's normally it's very easy sometimes it can give a little stain but who cares about the stain huh this looks better than it looked before another way so you take this spray and as usual, continue da, 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 da. and doing this many times. And now you're gonna use this one like this. You start here in the corner and you drag it all the way down. But here I need to dry it off a little. But the next time you see now the you have one part is clean and one part is still with the shampoo or the liquid to wash the window. Well, the, you start up here a little, you go in, you don't start here, you start a little here and then you angle this one a little like this. So you go down this way. See? And you continue till you have finished your window. And the last little one here. Well, and you can always clean a nice beautiful mirror. Same procedure, <clears throat> just a little smaller. I don't know why the mirror is getting so dirty. I don't know why. When we have so much beautiful person looking in the mirror, why is it so dirty always? <laughs> Maybe someone wants to stand a little close to see themselves better. You do the same procedure, a little nice and slow. Yeah, and then here it will be a little corner, will be a little bit difficult for me to using this tool. So I'm wiping it off with the newspaper. Well, good as new. It's pretty quick done, isn't it? And it looks wonderful now. Until one of the kids coming and say, oh, I, I, I cannot see my pimple here, huh? And then psh, it's dirt again, right? Well, as I told you before, the liquid you use should be water and soap. There is plenty to buy in the shop, but I'm not doing commercial. So uh, this one I mixed from some soap and I just add the water and then you just spray it on the window. These tools, well, they call professional, but I don't think they are super professional. But I just like this one and I have no idea of the brand or the name of this one actually. Um, this one I will say always buy one of a good quality of the rubber here. Because you buy cheap plastic the result will be horrible. And you are saving time using a, a good one. So don't be cheap on this one. Use a little money on this one. The rest of the products are almost free <laughs> you have soap in the house and you also have a cloth in the house but this one use real rubber here and when you use this a couple of years well you know rubber and plastic of course they they're getting a little old but I, I actually had this for at least five years so good luck